welcome to my youtube channel my name is peter shakespeare favor the slim giant or you can call me the smart mc nangula Vashimpundu, if you like if you've not subscribed to my youtube channel the best thing that you can do right now is hit the red button switch on the notification bell so that every time i post a new video you will be notified that Shimpundu has posted a new video. I'm back again on the words of wisdom to adulthood and today's topic is any woman who gets things from a man she doesn't love is a prostitute. <laughs> you heard me right. Any woman who gets things from a man she doesn't love is a prostitute. Catch me on the other side as we dig deeper into this topic on the words of wisdom to adulthood. Welcome back on the words of wisdom with me, Peter Shakespeare Fevered. Yes, and today's topic you heard me right. Any woman that gets things from a man she doesn't love is a prostitute. I must say this. A woman who gets things or gifts from a man she knows this man wants me. That's the reason he's giving me all these things. And she knows that she can't accept that man. That woman is a prostitute. Muchinyanda tuhule. They are just the same as those who stands on roadsides or those that who works in bars. The only difference that is there with those is the area of operation, where you operate from. Maybe your operation is smart. That's what you think. But then if you get things from a man you don't love, and you know that the reason he's giving me these things and gifts is because he wants me. Then you're a prostitute. It's very... It's a fact that a woman is able to know that this man wants me. But some of you out there are very selfish. You keep on getting, collecting, collecting, collecting. You are very selfish. But then you are a prostitute if you have that behavior if you don't love him don't get his money don't get gifts from him let him be let him be if you don't love him don't accept gifts from him because as you accept his monies and those gifts you are giving hope to that man to say one day this lady will accept me you are leading him on like that song for uh, tishon don't lead me on that sony konda kusovele samutima wanga chima baba so don't lead a man on if you know you can't love him and don't accept his gifts if you accept gifts from a man you do not love and you know he wants you you are a prostitute that's what i'm talking about today because some ladies are evil they can collect gifts from a man through his money and at the end of the day they will come and tell that man to say nothing can happen between you and me i've got somebody else that i love when in the actual sense they knew from the start that this man wants me it's the reason he is giving me all these things buying me gifts giving me money and all the things that he's doing for me ladies out there some of you behave yourselves if you know you can't love him things can't work out stop getting things from such a man then there is this type of ladies that gifts that gets gifts from married men 
this type of women who gets things from married men are prostitutes raised to power too if you didn't hear that one if you are a woman out there a lady out there who gets gifts from a married man or from married men you are a prostitute raised to power too because you even know that this man is married and trust me any married man if he has a side chick it's all about gifts exchanging with sex he gives you money he gets sex he gives you gifts he gets sex that's all about because he has a woman a wife already at home and whenever he's done with you he goes back to the wife and not stay with you you are just in it for sex and eating things from him why can't you keep your dignity your respect and wait for your own man so that you can have a marriage and trust me if you are doing that you are just sowing a seed one day when you get married there will be other people that will be doing that to you that's what this life is all about don't forget to reap what you sow in this life you go back and you don't even know how they save you in their phones these married men they save you crazy names Bapa Malasha, Bami Pando, Mbesuma. Funny names. It's because they know they can't be with you and they are afraid at home that when you call, the wife will see your name. So behave yourselves. Some of the ladies out there. Because next time in all these scenarios that I've talked about, when you mess up or the man messes up, we don't want to come and start reading hide my ID. We don't want to come and start reading hide my ID on um, what's this page again? Zambian weddings and kitten parties or a uh, I do Zambia. I do Zambia. No, hide my ID. This man did, 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 this, 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 and that. We don't want that. Just behave yourself and find your own man. Do that. Do that. If you don't want him, don't accept his gifts. Don't accept anything that comes from him you won't lose nothing at all actually if you don't accept things from a man that you know he wants me and you don't want him if you don't accept that simply means you have self-respect you are keeping your dignity you respect yourself and you will not lose anything at all But if you do it vice versa, getting things from a man you don't love and you know he wants me, you are a prostitute. If you get things from a married man and you know he's married, you are a prostitute, a race to power too. Stay away from those people. Respect yourself. Have dignity. It was me, your brother, Peter Shakespeare Favor, on words of wisdom to adulthood. See you next time on another topic. Enjoy the rest of the day. If you've not subscribed to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe. Hit the red button. Switch on the bell so that every time I post a new video, you will be notified that Vashimpundu has posted a new video. Bless you.